Hi everyone, I hope you're keeping safe and well. I just wanted to do a short video today about how COVID-19 is affecting property insurance, uh, but in particular premises which become unoccupied and those which were unoccupied already. So the majority of insurance policy wordings will contain a condition which states that if a property becomes unoccupied for more than 30 consecutive days, uh, then there'll be certain restrictions in cover and they'll generally impose a either weekly or fortnightly inspection of the premises which must be done internally and externally. Now, as we all know uh, the requirement from the government now is to stay safe, stay home um, and that's resulting in premises across the country now becoming temporarily closed and unoccupied. So what is the position uh, with regards to the insurance? Uh, well, it's been quite varied. Some insurers are still sticking with the 30-day unoccupancy warranty, uh, so they will restrict cover after this time and still will require that the premises are inspected. Um, others are being more flexible and allowing up to 60 or 90 days, or even as far as saying that if a premises becomes temporarily uh, closed because of COVID-19, then they will just waive the unoccupancy condition, which is really good. The situation though is different for premises which were unoccupied prior to the COVID-19 outbreak uh, and in generally insurers are sticking by their original conditions that the property must be inspected weekly or fortnightly, internally and externally uh, as before. I have to say, in my opinion, uh, it does seem a bit harsh when we're all being asked to stay home and stay safe and uh, not go out unless you really have to. Uh, so I know that some insurers are taking it on a case by case basis that if it isn't uh, practical for somebody to do this, uh, that you notify the insurer uh, and they'll review it. Uh, but it is really important uh, that you do speak with your insurer or your broker because if you don't inspect the property, uh, then you will be in breach of your conditions. And if a claim does need to be made, uh, there is a possibility that it won't be paid by the insurer. Either way, it's really important you do speak with your insurer or your broker and just find out what the position is uh, in terms of the cover you have uh, and the requirements uh, that they're making in terms of inspecting the premises. I hope that makes some sense and is of use. Um, we are members of BIBA, which is the British Insurance Brokers Association and the Chartered Insurance Institute. So we've got access uh, to both their online hubs, which they're updating daily with insurers updates. So uh, if you do have any queries, um, there's plenty of resource there for us to tap into uh, and we'd be happy to help you.